Hey students, welcome to scaria.com. Let's talk about development of ovarian follicle. The ogonium gets covered by a single layer of flat epithelial cells, the follicular cells, to form primordial follicle. The flattened follicular cells become columnar and form unilaminar primary follicle. Follicular cells proliferate to form several layers for formation of membrana granulosa. Follicular cells are now called granulosa cells. Primary oocyte and its granulosa secrete a glycoprotein substance that forms zona pellucida. This is called maturing primary follicle. Small fluid-filled cavities appear between the follicular cells called small lacunae. These cavities fuse together to form a large cavity antrum, and follicle is termed secondary vesicular follicle. Antrum increases in size and pushes oocyte toward one side of follicle. Granulosa cells that surround oocyte are called columnar sophoricus and those that attach oocyte to wall of follicle are called discus prolegaris. Stromal cells condense to form theca interna, some fibrous tissue get condensed to form theca externa. The ovarian follicle is now fully matured and is termed graphian follicle. If your books are giving you hard times, join us on scaria.com.